guys, welcome back to the Happy Oyster. Um, so I'm just in my comfy clothes today. Not didn't really do anything to make myself look nice for the video, but that's that's okay, right? You guys don't care. <laughs> um, for today's video, I'm gonna show you guys my sugar glider food preparation routine. So I don't really have a certain time that I feed the sugies. Um, it usually depends on whenever they wake up. They usually wake up um, around. 10:30 to 11. I know that's a little late. I don't. I don't know why. I guess they just love their sleep. Um, but yeah, that's that's usually whenever they wake up. So I usually feed them around the time that they wake up. Um, it's kind of early right now. It's it's six, but um, I can't do this too late. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you. So I feed the sugar gliders a variety of things. They eat a lot of different things weekly. Um, this is what they're going to get tonight. They're going to get mango, grapes, cucumber, a little bit of orange. Um, they really love nuts, so they have pumpkin seeds, pecans here. Um, okra, which this is the first time that they'll be eating it. They've never had okra before. Um, tomatoes, and yeah. But they do get other things like corn, banana, um, green beans, sweet peas. Sometimes they get stuff like that. Um, just not tonight. This is what I'm going to show you. This is what I'm going to cut up and give to them. Okay, so I'm I'm going to cut all of these fruits and veggies up real fine. Um, and I'll do a time lapse so that it doesn't take too long. Also, I wanted to mention something. The tomatoes, the cucumber, the and the okra are all from our garden, so they're getting fresh food from our garden. Okay, so I'm done chopping all of their food up, but I'm gonna add these nuts, because they, they really like nuts as well. I don't give them nuts every night though because it's a lot of fat. Also, sometimes I make a lot of food, a, a big batch, and then I just put some in their food bowl. and put the rest in a container to save for tomorrow or the next day. This also isn't the only thing that I give them daily. They also get um, HPW. Um, I make it from scratch though. I used to buy instant HPW from Exotic Nutrition, but I found out that it's actually not great for them and it's better to make make it yourself hold on a second guys just wanted to mention i actually got this information from a channel called sugar glider diaries i follow her on youtube and she has a lot of awesome educational sugar glider videos and if you want to know more on them you should definitely go subscribe to her channel so i started doing that it's it consists of honey oh god an egg which just tried to roll away from me <laughs> one egg and this is raw and unfiltered honey and I heard that you have to use filtered honey um, but this is actually what they would be getting in the wild it would not be filtered in the wild so this is this is okay if you're gonna give them honey you want to make sure you give them raw and um, organic honey and you don't want to give them anything with a bunch of fillers in it because it's really not good for them and then glider cow from exotic nutrition it just has calcium and magnesium in it. 
and it's calcium supplement for sugar gliders. And then you also need the egg, which is just for protein. Um, I'll add water, which you're supposed to add water, but I'll add water to it whenever I mix it all up in this, which is a um, additional piece to the to a blend, to my blender. Um, also, I forgot to mention, for this recipe, you'll need any kind of blending machine. Okay, so the first thing that I do is usually take my egg and crack it in a little bowl, what I have here. Ava? And I whisk this up. I like to use a knife for this part. And you want to cook the egg for this, so let's go to the microwave. So whenever you put your bowl of eggs in the microwave, you're gonna put it in there for 10 seconds and then take it out and stir it. And then put it in there for another 10 seconds and mix it, and then another 10 seconds and mix it until it's fully cooked. And then whenever you're done, you wanna cook it all the way and then you wanna mix it up like this. The little pieces. Then I just put it into the blender. Then you add your honey. Don't add too much because then it'll be really sweet. Then the glider cow, just take three pinches. And that's it. And then you want to add water. Only add about this much. Maybe even a little less, put a little bit too much. Then you blend it. And then whenever I'm done blending it, it's a liquid. And then this is the little bowl that I used to put their HPW in. So I'm just gonna pour some in there. Woo, kinda stinks. So this is their HPW they get every night. And if I have any any extra, um, I'll usually just put it in a little bowl with some tin foil over it and I'll use it like tomorrow night. So here's their fruits and veggies and their HPW. Um, I also wanted to mention that if you put a little bit more water than usual in your HP in your homemade HPW, then it will help to keep your shuggies more hydrated. And then there's the other part of their diet, which is their pellets. It, this stays in their cage 24-7. So if they wake up and they're hungry, then they can just eat this. Um, it's Vita Prima Sunseed, and we get it from Petco. Hey guys, I was editing my video, and I realized that I didn't tell you guys about their mealworms, the insect part of their diet. They do eat live mealworms. I do feed those to them weekly. Uh, I just, I guess I forgot to mention it, and I, I didn't have any at the moment, so I guess I just forgot. But they do get bugs. So guys, this is their whole diet. This is what they get every single night, except for their pellet stays in their cage 24-7. Um, but they're not going to wake up for like another three and a half hours because it's 740 right now. So I'm just going to put their pellets in their cage, and then I'm going to cut it, cover these and put them in the fridge, and I'll uh, put them in their cage whenever they wake up. Oh, and I wanted to show my dogs real quick. I don't know if you guys remember Walter. He was in, I think, one of my other videos before. But he hasn't been in any videos lately. Good boy. Much, much, much later. It's 11.33. I'm going to get out their food. They're, like, yapping in there, barking at me, like, give me my food now. Sorry the lighting's not great, guys dark so and my mom and dad are asleep Oop, the flash is on you guys got the nuts
Okay guys, I'm going to end the video here. If you enjoyed watching it, then give me a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.